When I hear black history, what actually comes to mind to me is just all the individuals that I am so familiar with that have worked so diligently just to pursue their specific careers and their specific paths. Some of the ones that stand out to me is like my mom and how hard she worked just to put food on the table and also my father and how hard he has worked over the years just to put food on the table. My journey arriving to this particular date <laughs> has been a very interesting journey. Um, I was born in Greensboro, North Carolina and I am the oldest of four siblings and we had we it was a very tough life however you know our parents they did the best that they could we're very fortunate to be where we are and i am very thankful for the journey that god has uh, put me on i am a graduate of shaw university i graduated with a bs degree in accounting I have always enjoyed working with math. Even when I was in school, uh, math has always been my favorite subject. So working with math always came easy for me. So I went to college, uh, received my four year degree at Shaw University, and I continue to be involved even with the Alumni Association at Shaw. So I am a proud Shaw Bear. <laughs> um, I started, actually, I've been working with Wake County Human Services where I'm currently employed. Um, at least 32 years now. I am currently the Department Budget Manager for Human Services. It is a very rewarding position. I am responsible for the overall budget for Human Services, which is a little over $200 million. And I'm also responsible for business planning, strategic planning, and financial models, which has also been very rewarding. But the most rewarding part to me is actually working with the staff that I've had the pleasure of working with, and also working with the group of people that's involved with the Human Services Agency. We provide services, economic, so, economic and social services, child welfare services, public health, clinical operations, and transportation related services. And I work with a great group of people who always uh, sacrifice their own time and just make time for others. So it's been very rewarding. Uh, the growth of Raleigh has really affected what I do today, um, mainly because there's so many opportunities just in the Raleigh area. And even with Wake County, we serve over 200 and something thousand people on an annual basis. So just this growth has just been amazing because I started back here, you know, it's been a while. And just being in this area, starting at Shaw University, a very small university, just seeing how Raleigh and the downtown area has evolved, it's just been really amazing. I give credit definitely to my Lord and Savior Jesus Christ for where I am today. I thank God for the opportunities that he has allowed me. I also give thanks to my husband. I am very appreciative of him. He's been very supportive. It hasn't always been easy because just balancing life and prioritizing time and, and just the management of time has been pretty challenging for us, but I just very, I'm very thankful for him. And I'm also very grateful for my children who have been an inspiration throughout the entire process. But definitely just keeping God first in every aspect of my life and definitely applying just uh, godly principles and God's truth in every aspect of my life and just whatever my hands find to do, just do it with all my might and it just has afforded me a lot of great opportunities. Um, well, most of the ministries that I am attached to at Upper Room has to do with being a servant. Um, just, just, you know, and I just really admire Pastor's theme uh, for this year as far as worship and servants. I enjoy working on hospitality. I enjoy working at the food bank. Those are some of the things that just brings me great pleasure and bring, brings me great joy. Just the opportunity to serve other people. I definitely look forward to the next chapter of my life and I know it will land somewhere in that arena as far as continuing to provide support to other people. I'm Patricia Pritchett and I'm a 2021 hero.